Yeah. The wheels say get hype on it. Yeah. You know, when we in town, you know, we in town. What up there, man? What up, player? What it do, what it do, man? Hey, man, no paper, no pen, man. We back. You know, we've been podcasting. We've been doing this all one before. We boy Third World. This is what MB promotion, you know how we do it, man. Turn it up for the 2020. So today, man, today we have some special guests. My special guest, hold on, drum roll. My special guest is the one and only. MB Promotions. You see him right here next to me. And my special guest is yours truly. Without a doubt, the clothing line specialist. Hey, you got oh yeah, yeah, yeah. See, I just got threw off, man. Let me, let me, let me reiterate that. Okay, go ahead. See, I just got through. I see how the devil was trying to cheat and trying to throw you. You see how the devil threw me out, but God put me right back on the track. Amen. 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 So, uh, the one and only entrepreneur, uh, 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 charity giver, philanthropist, uh. Pastor by day, preacher by night. Uh, the same haircut, having curly head. He rides the motor scooter sometimes, and sometimes he on the way to the bank, and sometimes he on the airplane. We gonna get to that later too. The one and only MB promotion. Me? I'm a guest on the no paper, no pen. What's up, man? What you got? Man, nothing much, man. Just so, um. So, so who your special guest? My special guest. Hmm. He uh, is de very well-rounded, and he's definitely um, an entrepreneur. Um, definitely um, be going on his way to the bank and um, clothing line. You know what I'm saying? Merch, uh, music, uh, actor, um, a father, good father, uh, business owner. Um, Cook, cook, chef, yep, chef, he's definitely chef, he definitely learned from the best. And um, comedian, a lot of people didn't know that, comedian. My guess is yours truly, third world. What? William Tane label. Me? Him. I often, like, he better be talking about me. Now, that's a lot of good stuff. Yeah, bro, I appreciate it, man. Stuff, man. So, no problem, man. No how you problem. been, bro? <laughs> Man, I've just been, you know, um, traveling, doing, doing my thing. I know you've you know been traveling saying? a lot. I know you've been traveling a lot. Yeah, and um, just matter of fact, just travel from um, Minnesota, man. After where all this is going on, I missed it, man. Um, That's what I was gonna ask you, man. Like you just had missed. You just was in Minneapolis. Yeah, I was. You get on that plane. You landed in Tampa in the south, mm -hmm. in Florida, and uh. How it feel like, 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 the, 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 just be there one moment, everything. All right, big man, hush, lay down. Be there one moment, and uh, the next moment, lay down. The next moment you here in the South, man, like, 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 how that feel? Man, it was like, it was good to get back home, definitely, man. When I heard everything that was going on, man, I was, a little concerned about my family back there, you know, my wife and the kids and stuff like that, you know, with everything going on, you know, because I, when I was there in Minnesota, Minneapolis, them cats was wild already before the riot started and stuff like that, so man, just... Yeah, I heard they like a baby in Chicago. Yeah, yeah, there's a lot of people from Chicago there, too. I also heard that, uh, what is it called, uh, the last of the dick land or something like <laughs> That was DC and Carlos Bean them said on they uh, on they little eighty five South so they was saying that it's the last of the uh that what niggas at niggas go at and they'll take care of the females take care of them. But uh you've been trapped, you've been back and forth on yeah, that. Definitely, you've definitely been scrapped up, man. So they don't got coronas on, on a plane, coronavirus. Man, listen, I was blessed and, and 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 just, you know what I'm saying, be able to go there and come back and and be safe, man. Not have a coronavirus, so I was, I was covered. I was definitely covered. That's what's up, man. So what you, what you, what you got going on? Man, I know you've been busy since I've been gone, man. You've been doing a lot of stuff. You got the studio, got the 
green screen, got the, you know what I'm saying? That was one of the things that you always wanted to do was get your own studio. So how, how that's going, producing and, and doing those things like that, man, in the studio like that, man? Well, quarantine came and, you know, I see everybody working from home. So I said, mm -hmm. well, I need to go with the board, go with the board, get on the right. board, work from home. And you know, I ain't know how to work with studio, I ain't mm -hmm. know how to work with camera, I ain't right. know how to do none of it. And I knew nothing. Mm -hmm. Thanks to the, the quarantine, because I had, I can't, you know, I can't just be no sitting, sitting duck. Yeah, yeah, yeah nah, yeah, and yeah. then Lil Will, you know, we got Lil Will on, on go now. My kids, yeah, son. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he got the new song in the video, too, man. Y'all can't stand on uh, YouTube. Go to Tame Label, man. Uh, Lil Will. That real spill, man. Yeah. So, yeah, Lil check Will, it out. Real spill, follow him. Lil Will 090719 on Instagram. Lil Will, well, no way, you know. So, yeah, I got him going on. He got his little hits and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm still in the lab. I just made a, a hit for my uncle, RP, Uncle Wilbur. Right, right. You know, they liking that, the feedback good on that. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm at the restaurant, um, Kareel's restaurant up there. Okay. Every day. Shout out to BJ Rude Boy. You know, we mm -hmm. took over. If y'all need any spot, it's, it's, it's a little spot where we can have parties and, you know, club night, mixtape release parties. Mm -hmm. Let me know, man. Y'all, you know, yeah, all that. Mm-hmm. Well, that's what's up, man. Well, one thing I want to know, man, I keep on hearing this in the air. I don't know who keeps saying this, but, you know, I got a nemesis out there, man. And, um, you know, the good thing, the nemesis, that I have is 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 a big man, close friend and, and and stuff like that. But sit down, hush, hush. Mhm. Mm yeah, a good friend of mine, and um, I've been hearing you know every now and then I hear I cook better than you. I've been hearing that in the air. I don't know what been going on, but you know on that grill, man. Um, you know um, I've been hearing you know. In, Man, I've been doing my thing, that's all I know. And the kids vouch you for it, the family okay. vouch you for it, everybody vouch you for it, so, you know. Okay, well, we're gonna have you know, to have another cook-off here. You know how that go, we can yeah. definitely do that. Oh, yes, sir. You know sir. what I'm saying? Yes, we can sir. definitely do that. Make sure y'all follow No Paper, No Pen Reality Show on IG. Subscribe to it on YouTube. Make sure y'all follow the Tame family on IG. Subscribe to it on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Follow Third World, 3 RRD World on IG. You know what I'm saying? Follow hit skits on IG. Listen, I'm gonna tell y'all something, man. Y'all following one thing and then be like, okay, I need some new stuff. Cause we we got so much stuff, so much material that it won't never run out. How much material you think you got? Man, we know it's ten years of material, man. Ten it years like, of old. material, people. Ten years from music to movies to the videos. Skits behind the scenes. Man, we the funny. We done been told we the funniest people. We the hardest rappers. We we the most handsomest. We the most talented. Yeah, we done heard all that. So we ain't nothing too many more people to say. Only thing we concerned on is about pushing our products, our music. You know what I'm saying? And these companies and entrepreneurs and these young folks, these youth, teen kids, man. The teen kids, man. What's up with them? The teen kids. They so take that, and it's like they have their own inter fame. Mm -hmm. They own inter fame, like they love themselves already. So mm -hmm. it, they just hard to keep up with, man. They hard to keep up with. I can't keep up with my own son and daughter. They, I know, man. I came here. Uh, I came to the studio the other day, man. Right, and exactly. the only thing I know is they was doing this and doing that, and they gone. Look, we had just got here, not even five right, minutes. Exactly. He's gonna ask me. Where my dad at? But you ask where your dad at, but he ain't staying here. You gone? Man, you got a whole cell phone. You can call. Me. See what I'm saying? It's just, it's, 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 out of, it's getting out of hand. But they always said that the kids are the future. So I would let them shine bright like diamonds. Mm. You know what I'm talking about? Go That's how we get. You feel me? Tampa, Florida. They had big riots and stuff like that. I don't. Uh, my opinion on it is, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be still be me, I'm still do me. That's my opinion. I'm gonna be me and do me, cause I know you're gonna do the same. So that's my opinion in case 
anybody want to know. I am still the CEO of the city. I am still that nigga, you feel me? But at the same time, like I said, I'm doing it. <laughs> hey, man, listen, this is just about the right thing, man. We got eggs, too, man. We got some boiled eggs. I was gonna eat some crabs. We got the grill out there popping with shrimp and chicken. We got crabs on the stove, crawfish, boiled eggs. You know what I'm saying? I think there's some corn in the freezer, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they got, um, man, since you're talking about the right thing, man, I got a call in yesterday, man, and they said, oh, get ready to break in the bush guard and let the animals go. Man, I'm like, what? Well, Break like in the, the bush guards and let the, which ones, the alligators? I guess the bears, the lions, or whatever. They should have gone and break in the bush garden and let all the animals free. You know what? That's a lot of money to be letting free, right? Mm -hmm. There's going to be a lot of people get ate. <laughs> and then a lot of trouble. You think you're scared of the police? The letter bell knock on your door. Man, listen. It's over there in China, they were letting dogs on lions out. If you don't come, if you try to come outside after night, there's <laughs> a lion at the door waiting for you. No. Yeah. Man, I'm like, these Chinese people hard, boy. These Chinese people. Oh, they hard. told them, oh, they're going to lock down. They're going to lock down, yeah. No. Yeah, let them, got dogs on lions out. Like, okay, and these people still sneaking out. Man, look, I ain't hear nothing about nobody sneaking out. I don't know about the one in China, no dog on. The old guy was lying. No, fuck around here. It's still been trying to sneak out. Right. I mean, I'm trying to give me some liquor. Ah! Fuck <laughs> that. The old guy was lying. I know it. It was, it was me. <laughs> well, I had to be me, though. <laughs> so, we get some liquor, man. I forget that line. We can't catch me. <laughs> Sound familiar, y'all. <laughs> I'm not in the spaceship. I ain't say anything possible, so that's how my mind go. Mm-hmm. So yeah, man, so you got the new music, you got the studio, you got lots of oh the clothing line, man. You can't forget about the clothing line, man. You got some new stuff coming out, man. Y'all make sure y'all come up there and check them out at right up there the rule boy, man. Yeah, for right real. Right down the basket. Y'all know how to find us. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, what else been going on, man? I know I heard you got the Butter Lotion Series popping. Uh, man, yeah, me and um, Brad been working with me on that. So, yeah, man, since I know it was a commercial break, but before the commercial break, uh, you were, we were talking about the Butter Lotion thing with you and Brad. Tell yeah, about man. that. Well, man, it's just, it's just something that just basically just came off the top of our head, man. You know how we do no paper, no pen. And um, it was, what happened was, it was some bread. And um, the bread, everybody, I, you know what I'm saying, everybody, first I, I heard a voice, you know what I'm saying, butter lotion, butter lotion. And where I went, it was butter lotion. So after that, man, we just kind of went on. And um, went on to the story, man. Y'all can go check it out on Hit Skits, so H I T Z Skits, S K I T Z. And um, man, I think y'all like that. We got a two part series on that, on that one right there. We're gonna plan on doing some more with the movie and everything else like that too. So y'all, y'all check that out, man. And it's going from there, man. Movies and skits. I, I'm working with someone in Africa as well too, with a movie called Azuzu. So. And y'all be able to check that out real soon too, so. That's what's up, man. I, I, I also got a track with this dude, the Dominican Republic. Okay. It's a Spanish track. I'm I heard, I'm on the hook. Okay. So shout out my boy, Dominican Republic, man. I don't I mean, I'm trying, I'm getting the lyrics. I'm getting the, mm -hmm. matter of fact, I'm on a verse. I'm on both of the verses. And the hook is Spanish, but it's Spanish and English. Track. Okay. So shout out to him, shout out to uh, DSP down South Player mm -hmm. University, the door one is going down speed. You know what I'm talking about? And uh, he, uh, I see you got some, some new shoes on, so uh, you got your style bike. I see 
Yeah. And you weren't dressing like that in Minneapolis, was it? Nah, I wasn't dressing like this. What? Nah. How was your style up there? Man, you know, just more jeans, Levi's, you know. So you thought you were uh, 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 young and fine up there? Yeah, young and fine. You can down here and be old school and fine because everybody right know you. Right. Ah! <laughs> play, play! I see you don't cut your dread. Yeah, man, I cut my hand. They locked me up, sent me to jail. Oh, Lord. Yep. They like, it's the first thing they say, why you cut your hair? <laughs> That's why y'all got me detained. Cause you cut your hair. Yeah, man. I'm gonna, yeah, I know. I did not catch nobody. I'm trying to be a good role model. I'm trying to be positive. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to be positive. Ain't nothing wrong with that, man. You gotta stay positive in this world. You know what I'm saying? With everything going on, coronavirus, riots, and everything, you gotta keep a sane mind to live in this world right now. So keep on doing what you're doing. You know, keep on pushing. That's yeah, yeah. all you can be, all yeah, the way around. Yeah. We gonna do that, you know what I'm saying? I wanna shout out everybody that's participate with us, man. Everybody that's been there from the jump, man. Everybody that's going hard right now, man. Stand up, write your plans out, get you some sticky papers, put them around your house. It's time for us to go. It's time to let's go, man. Let's go like the real hill, let's go like the water, like the Mississippi River. Do that, go. Yeah, that go all the way up to Minneapolis, too. I mean, I've got 10,000 lakes. That part. 10,000. I mean, you can be found anywhere in the lake. 10,000 on them. Let's go. So y'all tighten up. Let's go. Let's ride. Y'all heard the CEO right there. Tain later. William Tain later. And we know that time. swag, man. We always had Tain. You know what I'm saying? Tank it on bang. You feel me? Keep doing what y'all doing, man. If you're doing something good, keep doing it. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? You know There's no paper, no too. pen. And guess what? We need content. Give us ideas. Give us content. If you're trying to be a guest on the show, let us know. That you part. know what I'm saying? We 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 doing videos now. Mm -hmm. We got the studio. You know what I'm saying? Have y'all want it, man? Be an entertainer, man. Have you want it? You know what I'm saying? We got the clothes. You know what I'm saying? We funny. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Females, I got baby suits on deck right now. How that? You know what I'm saying? I, like I got some silk shirts coming. Oh, 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 look, look, look. I'm telling you, because once I start by getting bite, and then they're going to be like, oh, oh, oh. And so that's how it's going to go. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I've been focused on school and, and trying to do a little. I have a little legal problems going on, you know what I'm saying? But a small thing to a giant. And. You've been handling like a champ, though. Amen. You've been handling like a champ. I appreciate you know what I'm saying? Standing in the paint for me, and I appreciate you standing up for me. Yes, sir. Vice versa, you know. So, yes, man, sir. we just gonna go keep hard. on pushing each other, man. Go harder, and you know what I'm saying. Do our best, especially when you know a person can do better. You know what I'm saying you don't get behind the push. It's just how you talk to them and how you react to them. And sometimes you gotta just listen to what the person is saying because they might have a better idea. You might be talking about the same thing, but it's a better way of doing it. So I, I appreciate you for that, you know what I'm saying? Right. Showing me a better way to do it, because I'm, I'm older, stuck in my ways, you know what I'm saying? But I can be stuck in my ways, or you can say, you know, you stuck in your way, but let's do it like this right here, stuck in your way, that way, bam. I would say, let's do it like this, stuck in your way. Here, uh, Yeah, man. We here, man. We here, man. No paper, no pens. Our everyday life, the reality show. Give us some content, you know what I'm saying? So far, niggas just been cooking. Good food, you know what I'm saying? Anybody think they can cook better than me, man? We could tag them, we could do it two on two. We could do it two on two, that's nothing. Because we have the sauce. Right. Tang. It is. So, yeah, man, get us, man. We gonna, you know, make sure y'all watch our, uh, our pranks. We did the Uber prank, he did the Uber prank on me. Make sure y'all go to Team Family and watch that. Mm -hmm. uh, what else we did? We did a little video. Yeah, we did that. Um, having and having winning. Having winning. Yup. Yeah, we did that. You know what I'm saying? A little green screen. A little something we're working on, you know. Yep. We Got did a little winning come. video. So, mm -hmm. And this is our first, you know what I'm saying, time sitting down. You know, so we didn't have so much going on. So Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So let us know how we did. Like this thing up. Subscribe this thing up. Comment. Put that bell notification on. You did. 
Cause so we gonna be dropping. Yeah, you did like a shovel. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And uh, we don't got swag. We got team, man. I'm paying for the team. The awesome network of God, yeah, you know, I mean, I know, you know, it's a little show. We gonna make it a little show. They got curfew. They got us on curfew. So yeah, everything yeah, we're doing yeah. is they shout and we mm -hmm. trying to speed, trying to hurry up. Right. So uh, anything else you had to say? Uh, nah, man. Just just unification, man, and come together, man. Let's do it, man. No talk. Let's put something in the action, man. If y'all with us, you're with us. If you're not, then, you know, we still love you. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for MB Promotion, my special guest. Y'all give a round of applause, big applause, big hands for Third World, my Woo! guest. Yeah, man, man, man. Give it up, give it up. Hey, man, until next time, we are. No paper, no pen, saying it. Let's go. It's damn Mike, get this fucking mic off of me. I'm tired of this shit. Y'all not paying me enough. I'm quitting next week if you motherfuckers don't up my pay. Get this fucking mic off of me.